welcome to ATCM, the emergency medicine channel. Today we are discussing about the drug dobutamine. So what is the drug classification? Dobutamine is a synthetic dopamine analog. So coming to mechanism of action. Even though it is a dopamine analog, it have no action on dopamine receptors. It is a selective beta 1 receptor. The main action is beta 1 more than beta 2 more than alpha 1. And it is a potent ionotrope and it have mild vasodilatory action. So uh, coming to indications. First one is cardiogenic shock. So what is cardiogenic shock? Hypotension with bradycardia. It is the cardiogenic shock. So based on this uh, mechanism of action, that is it is a potent ionotrope. So it may increase the stroke volume and increase the heart rate. And since it is a mild vasodilatory action it is having, it will reduce the systemic vascular resistance and all together it may increase the cardiac output. So this is one uh, indication that is cardiogenic shock. Second indication is persistent hypoperfusion despite fluid resuscitation and other uh, vaso vasopressin uh, or ionotropic support and the third indication is later stages of cardiac failure. So there are three indications, one is cardiogenic shock and other is persistent hypoperfusion despite fluid resuscitation and vasopressin use and then late, uh, late stages of cardiac failure. Then root it is usually given as IV. So coming to dose and infusion, it mainly comes as ampule that is one ampule may contain 5 ml which may contain 250 mg of dobutamine. So coming to dosing. Adult dose is 2 to 10 microgram per kg per minute and the maximum dose is 20 microgram per kg per minute and the pediatric dosage is 0.5 to 1 microgram per kg per minute. So the uh, dosing is adult doses uh, 2 to 10 microgram per kg per minute maximum of 20 microgram and pediatric dosage is 0.5 to 1 microgram per kg per minute. So if you are setting up an infusion, how we will set an infusion? So this may contain, we usually take uh, 1 ampule. 1 ampule of dobutamine that is it may contain 5 ml solution. We will mix it with 45 ml NS. So it may make it 50 ml. So 5 ml contain 250 mg. So this 50 ml contain 250 mg that is 1 ml containing 5 mg. This is the dilution for setting up of a infusion. Then coming to adverse reaction, then we told it is a potent ionotrope. So it may cause tachycardia and hypertension and there will be ventricular ectopics which may cause palpitations and another adverse reaction is anaphylaxis. So these are the uh, adverse reaction that is increase in heart rate, tachycardia, hypertension, adverse uh, ventricular ectopics which may cause palpitations and anaphylaxis. And coming to contraindication, if there is hypersensitivity, uh, if hypersensitivity is, is an contraindication and if there is uh, um, obstructive cardiomyopathy that is hypertrophic cardiomyopathy with uh, outflow tract obstruction, if it is the uh, the dobutamine is contraindicated.
So, these are the two contraindications. One is hypersensitivity to the drug and hypertrophic cardiomyopathy with outflow tract obstruction. So, this is all about dobutamine. Thank you.